All right, guys, welcome back to Outdoor. We're gonna be shooting a couple videos today. We are in the second week of July. I'm gonna show you how to attract deer fast to your property, no matter what the size is, big or small. I'm gonna show you what works best for me. And also, we're gonna go check the trail cameras. We just put them out last week, last Sunday. Today's Sunday, so it's been a week. I'm excited to see what velvet buck show up on the Browning trail camera. So stay tuned guys. We got a little bit of a drive to the hunting property. Once we get there, um, I'll take you guys back with me and we'll go from there. I got a little bit of work to do on the trail every year to maintain the trail that we put in that goes through the property. It's a 20 acre piece of private land in Harford County, Maryland. So, you know, during the spring and the summer when we get some rain, things overgrow, trees fall and stuff like that. So there's always maintenance to do, but the deer do use that trail that we put in pretty heavy. So um, we need to make sure we keep that clear. Stay, there's always something to do in the off season when hunting. So we're also gonna do that too and uh, make sure the deer can get around there like they want to. And also so we can access our stands. But if you haven't subbed, make sure you smash that subscribe button down for me. Leave this video a like, guys, if you like these types of videos. Ring that notifications bell, too, so you get all my new content as soon as it drops. And please share this video. All right, first stop, Starbucks. Hi, welcome to Starbucks. What can I get started for you? Can I get a venti pink drink with no strawberries and sweet vanilla cold foam? Uh, of course. What else can I get for you? That's it. You got it. Your total is 642 at the window. Okay. You guys got to try one of these. Hit your local Starbucks. It's got coconut milk in it. And it tastes like strawberries, but the coconut milk really hydrates you. So if it's hot, like a hot day, I like to get them as much as I can. But And then the sweet cold foam on the top, just, it's really good. You just got to try one. Okay. Alright, good. Your total six forty two. Thank you. There you go. Have a Thank you. Day. You too. That right there. We'll make your day better. That's just happiness. Alright, let's get to the hunting property. I'll see you guys in a minute. Welcome back to Outdoor, guys. Today, I'm going to do a video on how to attract deer fast to your property. And I use Big Time. And I'm going to go over what exact products I use from them. It's been the most consistent for me. And... I hunt a 20 acre piece of property and I have farms all around me so there's a big advantage to drawing deer off a neighboring property especially when certain food sources aren't available for that time of year and a great way to take advantage of having a shot at a mature buck is to just put corn down you know they're real relaxed during the early season there's not hunting pressure or anything like that so these bucks move around more they're less cautious and if they can go into some kind of cover somewhere instead of an open corn field or a bean field um, corn's not available till later in the summer but you know if you're giving it to them when it's not available anywhere else that's what's going to make you stand out and then bucks are going to show up now you can hunt whatever way you want to hunt um, i know there's a lot of opinions you know by putting bait down and stuff like that you're bringing the deer to you I have nothing against scouting or anything like that. I think it's really fun and I like the challenge of hunting, but um, I feel like also you want to make the best out of what you have. Um, we do have acorns here, you know, when they drop, but there's no real main food source. There's like forage here and stuff like that, but as far as a main crop or anything like that, we just don't have it here. So, you know, this is my opinion and this is the way that i hunt and i want to share it with you guys so hopefully it might help one of you guys out i do start baiting early pretty much spring uh, i've been putting big time the cherry rush the fortified deer blend that's in a black bag and red 
Um, I've been putting that down since really the end of May and I'll feed them all the way up to September when opening day is um, and they will rely on it as a primary food source and I believe the buck that I took last year on opening day he was bedded close to this food um, so it's something it does take work it does cost money um, I'm not just giving them regular corn I'm giving them good stuff you know that vitamins and minerals that they wouldn't get out of regular corn which also helps promote antler growth so I'm giving them good stuff I don't mind paying for that um, I know I'm helping the deer now I haven't tried every attractant on the market or anything like that I have tried a good amount of them now and the big time has always came through for me especially early and late season and it always attracts the bucks like I always have bucks that show up to it um, I do put regular corn down with it now um, there is corn mixed in with the big time blends but I put regular corn just in case they want that so you could argue that they're coming into the corn but at the same time you know I've always put them both so I feel like they're benefiting a lot more from the big time as well it also has that cherry rush scent and that gets them coming in I feel like they can smell that from further away but anyway I'm gonna go through the three bags that I'm using, um, let you know what's in it. I'll show it to you guys. Um, I would definitely recommend it. I'm going to drop their website down in the video description below so you guys can try it out. Um, give it a shot. Um, it's not the cheapest stuff, but at the same time, I understand the cost because of all the, like I said, all the nutrients that's in this stuff is really good for the deer, especially when their antlers are growing and stuff. And they have some other products you guys can check out. You know in case that's you know something there's something else that you guys want to try or look at or need but um so i got try to get down here i got the this is brand new this is the big time platinum and this this actually has it's a blend of corn roasted soybeans peanuts milo sunflower seeds protein pellets and big time nitro mineral and vitamin supplement okay and, and all of these that i'm going to go over have the same cherry rust scent so the next one i'm going to go over is which i've been using for a couple years is the protein plus that's that's the black and yellow bag um the platinum is kind of like a gray and black bag but the protein plus um i really like this one because fortified deer blend with roasted soybeans. I feel like the bucks really crave them roasted soybeans, especially when they're not available. But I've noticed this has really helped me out during the colder months and later season. Um, they tend to come hit that really good. And then this one right here is the red and black bag. This is the big time. Let me try to get over here. Fortified uh, deer blend. And this one is a premium blend of corn, milo, and sunflower seeds, fortified with big time nitro, mineral and vitamin supplement. Um, so this one I'll put down early season first with just a couple bags of regular corn until they start hitting it heavy. And then once that happens and it gets closer to opening day, I'll put some of the big time protein plus and stuff because I know them soybeans work um, and then this this platinum I'm trying for the first time this year so we'll see what happens I already have bucks coming though so but I have been putting the red and black big time fortified deer blend down cherry rust since the beginning so I just want you guys to know all that up front this might turn into like a couple video series on this um, depending on how much footage I get and stuff like that but i'm gonna roll in the trail cam footage i got three trail cameras out you know i'll show you guys what shows up but i already have like i said i already have some nice bucks showing up to this stuff so i'll include that stuff too because i have some of that but i just want to try to give you guys some tips and most importantly let you guys know what works for me so it can help you guys out um there's a ton of stuff on the market guys and i know it's tough um maybe if you're a new hunter or like you just hunt a piece of property like me that just doesn't have the food um this will take care of that um all right let me get these bags open and then i'll show you guys you know what's in each bag 
and then we'll put the stuff out. Stay tuned. All right, let's check out the big time platinum. Try to give you guys a good look at that. And guys, this smells so good. <laughs> I, have, I have bags of this stacked in my kitchen. I just always have to have this stuff because, you know, with the COVID and stuff, it was hard to get. And uh, I do put it out every week. So, but. All right, let's check out the Protein Plus. Protein Plus looks like. Okay, and then let's check out the the big time fortified deer blend. This one seems to have the most corn in it, guys. Um, and I'll put some B-roll in so you guys can get some more time with seeing exactly what's in there. And before I dump it, I'm going to go over the nutritional facts and stuff. Just to make sure I cover everything. Stay tuned. Alright guys, let's start with the Big Time Platinum. And you can see here, watch your herd grow with Big Time Platinum Premium Deer Blend. A blend of corn, roasted soybeans, peanuts, milo, sunflower seeds, and protein pellets fortified with Big Time Nitro, Mineral, and Vitamin Supplement. Big Time Platinum also includes Triad Opti Rumen Revolutionary Feed Technologies combined to promote a healthier herd through their diet. Okay. Um, promotes digestion and utilization of nutrients, optimizes animal performance, supports antler growth, aids in doe lactation and fawning. Feeding instructions placed directly on the ground or in any type of gravity feeder or trough replenish as needed real quick another tip I want to give you guys is I've had better luck come on focus here we go I've had better luck with just dumping this stuff on the ground versus a feeder I have ran feeders and as soon as bow season kicked off they would not come to it um, the mature bucks seem to like it on the ground better so that's what i would recommend but you do want to watch out for a couple things the humidity is one um not much you can do about that but and you know the feeder does help with raccoons squirrels and stuff like that but um, i just leave it on the ground when i dump it just watch for low spots like where water would sit you don't want to sit in the real wet stuff especially because the summer spring and summer you get a lot of rain um, they eat it pretty quick though just don't put too much out you don't want to sit in too long. I haven't really had a huge problem with molding or anything like that. But excellent source of protein, minerals, vitamins, and essential fatty acids can be fed year round. Great inventory tool. That's another thing. When you dump this stuff, guys, um, you'll see what bucks are around. It gives you, you know, great inventory on what's trotting around your property. Um, I do want to show you. Um, all the like percentages and stuff of all the uh the proteins and stuff like that i'm just gonna i don't know if i'm gonna run down them i'm just gonna show you a picture of them so in case you guys were you know curious about that you can see it i mean you can head over to big times website too i'm sure they got all that listed there you don't want to feed this to sheep guys the product contains copper which is toxic to sheep but here's all your vitamins and minerals and stuff and you know how much they have added all right let's go ahead and move on to the protein plus watch your herd grow Big Time Protein Plus, a blend of roasted soybeans and wholesome grains fortified with Big Time Nitro, mineral, and vitamin supplement. Attract, develop, grow. Deer eat it up. Powerful, attractive. Big Time Protein Plus has the tantalizing aroma and delicious flavor of cherry rush that deer can't resist. 
And real quick, guys, that stuff does smell really good. It smells fruity. Um, I really love the smell of it. Like I said, I keep it in my kitchen. Um, and it's always smelling good down there. There are 11 different minerals in the antlers of whitetail deer. Big Time Protein Plus provides essential minerals, allowing antlers uh, to reach their maximum potential. Whitetail deer need that mineral. You can't see that. Antioxidants and other nutrients are critical. Um, for whitetail deer, I think it says to live healthy lives. Um, Big Time Protein Plus provides vitamins A, D, and E, antioxidants that may be lacking in the natural habitat of whitetail deer. Antioxidants have been shown to improve health and longevity. Vitamins plus healthy deer equal big racks. Fortified with nitro, mineral, and vitamin. Um, again, I'm just going to show you guys real quick what's in this. I gotta get out of here before I blow this spot up. I'm leaving my scent everywhere for you guys. I was gonna do this somewhere else, but I had to open the bags to show you guys everything. So, but that's just part of it. Trying not to draw this out. It just takes some time. Okay, here we go. Watch your herd grow with big time fortified deer blend, a premium blend of corn, milo, sunflower seeds, fortified with big time nitro, mineral and vitamin supplement. Okay, here we go. We just read all that. It's the same thing on on this bag here let's see there are 11 different minerals in the antlers of a white-tailed deer big time fortified deer blend provides essential minerals allowing antlers to reach their maximum potential um, minerals and antler development heat it up vitamins plus healthy deer could be racks big time fortified deer blend provides vitamins a d and e along with essential fatty acids omega-3 and omega-6 these antioxidants and fatty acids may be lacking from the white-tailed deer's habitat and have been shown to improve health and longevity. Fortified with nitro, mineral, and vitamin supplement. Again, let me show you all the bottom of this bag. This one, I'm kind of glad I just remembered that. Um, where is that at? I want to tell you guys all right i want to show you guys the weight of these bags are different so i'm gonna run through that real quick too i gotta find it let me see where you at made in the usa Let's see. okay it's right here on the front of the bag on the bottom all right so the the big time fortified deer blend is you get a 40 pound bag of that okay and I'm gonna look up the price because I forget what they are I want to say it's around 15 or 16 bucks depending on where you get it from that's the other thing I check your local tractor supply code because they had um, I had the protein plus ship to store and they usually carry the big time fortified deer blend sometimes they'll carry protein plus closer to the season uh, the platinum I had to order I think it was from Bass Pro or Cabela's yeah so Tractor Supply has it for $14.99 Bass Pro and Cabela's has it for $16.99 alright let's go to the protein plus it looks like Tractor Supply has that for $14.99 but it's not a 40 pound bag guys let's uh see what this one is I know it's, it's not as much in here Yeah, this is only a 25 pound bag. Okay. All right, now let's check the platinum out. All right, the platinum Bass Pro has for $24.99. It looks like Gander has it for $18.99. So um, they stay pretty much consistent for the most part in price, but. Just shop around online, guys, or like I said, check, you know, Tractor Supply is really the only one that I've seen that carries this stuff. All right, let's check and see how big of a... Pretty sure this is the same as the Protein Plus. Actually, this is a little bit bigger. You get a 30-pound bag 
of the platinum. All right, guys. I think I covered everything. Um, I know there's a lot of people that aren't so nice about baiting deer and stuff like that. Just make sure it's legal in your state. Um, it is here in Maryland. So the end result is the same as far as I'm concerned. As long as you get the deer down that you wanted, whether you hunt trophies or not, um, that's all that really matters, you know? Like you can have different opinions. Oh, I hunt this, I hunt that. You know, I'm going to try to do better and push myself to try to find a farm to hunt because I've never hunted natural food or a farm. I've been hunting since I was a kid. My dad always took me and my brother. I'm 35 now. I just started bow hunting a couple years ago. So I don't know everything, you know, and I'm learning. But like I said, this works for me. It's hard to guarantee anything depending on your food sources and what area you're in and all that stuff plays a role in this but like i said i'm completely confident in recommending this stuff to you guys it can't hurt to try it this has worked consistently for me over the years so you know if i put in the work and spend the money and stuff to do something and i can save you guys a headache and save you some money and you know recommend you something that you know has worked i'm going to let you guys know about it so Thanks for tuning in. Stay tuned. We're going to be dropping these types of videos every week. I had to let you guys know real quick too. I'm not sponsored by Big Time or anything like that. I spend my own money on it. Um, if they want to, what's up? Let's talk. Um, I love your stuff. I have no problem with putting positive good things out there that work. All right, I'm going to get this corn out here. And uh, this is the other stuff. I'm just putting... I didn't really go over it. This is just regular deer corn. This is made by Record Rack, but you know, it's nothing special. It's just straight corn. I'd like to put that out just maybe to keep the squirrels off the good stuff and they grab that or in case the deer wants something that's, you know, no flavor on or something like that. I put that out like I said before. All right, I literally got you guys hanging from a tree right now. Um, just when you're spreading the stuff out though, Try to spread it thin, try not to stack it on top of each other. The deer like to dig around for it and work a little bit for it. So, And also if it rains on it, it'll help it dry quicker so you don't have mold issues. You can see behind me, I put the regular corn out. Um, I'm gonna start with the red and black bag, the big time fortified deer blend. And then I'll do the protein plus and then the platinum. And then I'll quit talking your ear off at some point. Not that it really matters either, but uh, I usually put the regular stuff down first and then I'll sprinkle this on top. Give it some flavor. All right, one down, two to go. As I'm looking around, guys, there's just a tad bit of molded corn, and it's, it's really hardly anything. the uh, protein plus let's do the platinum It smells so good back here. I gotta get out of here though. I've been back here like two hours. Making a racket, sweating, stinking, filming. 
I hope there's nothing that I forgot to go over. I'll probably think of it when I get home. That's usually how it goes, but I guess that's how it goes sometimes. And, you know, there's going to be more videos. So, but, uh, all right, guys. If you haven't subbed, though, make sure you smash that subscribe button down for me. <laughs> Give me a like for at least blowing my hunting spot up for you guys, putting my scent everywhere. Drop a comment. Let me know what you want to see. Um, let me know if you've used this big time stuff before, if you guys use it now. Ring that notification bell so you know when my next video drops. Share this video too, please, if you would. It helps me out. Until then, you have officially been outdoors.